one. You are one in 360, William. No, you are one in 360, and so are all of you guys. You're actually one in a million. We have entered San Marino's Eurovision 2018 selection, one in 360, and the wild card round is open, and we really, really need your support. Should we talk about this? Let's do this! Yes, San Marino is searching for the internet candidate, and when we heard that, we instantly were reminded that our passion for Eurovision was born on the internet. It's really what brought you and I together, all of the wee wee bloggers together, and perhaps more importantly, all of our viewers and readers who we communicate with every single day on social media and on YouTube. And so we thought, why not jump in? Because we both love music, we love Eurovision, and we have a strong connection to San Marino. And you're talking too much, because you've forgotten the genesis of this was um, a sort of a hoax where Total Slade Realness Honey was entered as our entry, and we knew nothing about it. Oh yeah, this. someone put on Wikipedia <laughs> ages ago that we were singing at Eurovision 2017 with the song Total Slayer Drill is Honey. For San Marino. For San Marino, and like, it started off mocking us, but actually we thought that's an idea we'd love to bring to life. It planted a seed, and I think what's more interesting is out of that joke came an ambition, and yes. I tell you the truth, we both wanted to sing. Oh. We're a lot. It's a real ambition. I, I've heard you sing, Devin. Your R&B styling, the way I'm you I'm on rap. point. I'm good. No, you're on point. Maybe then one day, every soul heals and we'll find a way. And maybe... I love you, Valentina! <laughs> As you know, I did beauty pageants for many years. Miss Harmon, honey! I, I, it was high five. Yeah, thank you. It was for women. And what was your talent? Well, I told the tons. Because I wanted to sing, but a lot of the other contestants were singing, and back then I lacked the confidence to really put my voice out there. But you, you know, overcompensated. For it. <laughs> Thank you. You know, I've been working really hard with my voice coach and like some of the Eurovision stars. Actually, a lot of the Eurovision stars have been helping us behind the scenes work on our voices for the competition, and some of them have some uh, take a look messages of support. So take a look. Roll the fan. Devin and William, my friends! Oh my god, I'm so excited you guys are gonna, going to represent San Marino because for sure you're going to do it. I'm supporting you. I, want, I really want to see you next year in the Eurovision on the stage, not in the backstage. I think I'm going to interview you and I wish you good luck. I love you guys. See you. Hello people! Devin and William for Eurovision Song Contest. You're going to rock this world, babies. <laughs> Yo, Devin and William Ponte! I wish you guys a lot of luck, and I know you're gonna do that. <laughs> Everybody's looking at me now. Um, I uh, send you the nicest greetings, and I hope you guys have fun, and good luck with everything. Mwah. Hello, my lovely Devin and William. I heard that you are trying with the national selection of San Marino, so I want to give you a big support. I want to wish you a good luck, and you know that Slavka supports you, and I hope that you will rock the stage and represent San Marino 2018 in Lisbon. Hey, what up, Devon and William. Hope you represent San Marino in the next Eurovision, so love you so much, and a lot of kisses. Hello, my dear William and Devon. You have all my support. Good luck, good luck, good luck. See you soon, guys. Hey, Devon and William, what's up? This is Robin. I just wanted to say that I fully support you to, to uh, perform in the Eurovision for San Marino, and I hope to see you on the TV. Hi, Devon and William. We want to support you. <laughs> yes, it's amazing. It's incredible it's a, for us. It's an amazing idea. You need to try. Please, Devon and William. Going to Eurovision! Oh, oh, Eurovision uh, 2017 with you. No, 2018. 17. Oh, 2017. Oh, okay, Senior. we are. Okay, we are with you, of course. Oh, that is so sweet. I mean, that really gets me quite emotional. And like, I want to do what they say. We want to go on that stage and slay, not just for us, but for all of the fans of Eurovision, the internet community. 
Some people have thought this was a joke, that we were trolling. And do you know what I love about this whole assignment is that the whole project actually does connect people. Yes. There's very little I can do, but together we can achieve great. Choreographers, dancers, yeah. music vocalists, yeah. editorial, I mean yeah. like, Eurovision is more than just that three minutes on stage, Absolutely. but our, you know, our readers know that. And you know what, a lot of people think you have to be Celine Dion to sing, or you have to be Celine Dion or you know, Mariah Carey to put your talent out there, but no, we're here to say, you can be Britney and you can still go to Eurovision. You don't have to have the voice of an angel, you can have the voice of autotune and you can still slay. She Victor and Samir. She has seven platinum albums. Yeah. Uh, Victor and Samir, a melody festival and staple. You know, Backing vocalist. Killing it. And you know what? Evald. He can dance. <laughs> the thing is, there are other comp compensatory elements which have made these acts kind of endearing. It's all about sharing the love, the entertainment. We have been told we have no discernible vocal ability, but I want to show you that whether you have that vocal ability or not, you can still slay. That is my message for Europe. Well, my message is I love this contest. I'm passionate about the brand Eurovision and everything that's in it. I want to experience it in, in all facets, in all forms, in yeah. all guises. And what better way than to actually be on stage as part of a national Hashtag selection? Hashtag come together, celebrate diversity. Feel your heartbeat. I wasn't born in Europe, but you know what? I'm here now. I'm currently being naturalized as a British citizen. And I, it's part of the story of Eurovision. Are you sharing the moment? Oh, I'm sharing the moment with my relatives in Vietnam, my family in America, and our glorious Eurovision family here in Europe. And there's another point that we have to talk about. I saw online a hater said, oh, if they go to Eurovision, well, good. They won't be in the contestants business interviewing them. I say the opposite. <laughs> we'll be backstage doing interviews, bringing you even Green closer. room hunting. Yeah. So you're not just going to get Eurovisions at the preview interviews from the pre-parties. You're going to get interviews backstage, in the dressing room, on the tour. It's going to be even better. We can take our coverage to another level. level. <laughs> But do you know what? For that reason alone, I'm actually now fully committed to this. Oh, money I'm fully committed. <laughs> I'm fully committed, but look, we need support. We can't get there alone. This is a project for all of us, and we would love, love, love your support. So if you can find it in your heart, please vote in this internet wild card. It would mean the world to us. Oh my god. What song are we gonna sing? Total Slage Realness Honey. <laughs> What's the one? What's now don't give away our oh harmonies. Let's not give away our harmonies no, no, no. just yet. There was one about San Marino. Oh, le listen. We're gonna keep the song a secret, but we'll just say some composers from Eurovisions of past have been in touch, and they're quite keen to work with us on the single that we've been kind of stewing and cooking on. You will not no believe clues. who they are. Devin, but I... no clues. No clues. Uh, so we're just gonna conclude this by saying, Thank you so oh, much. Oh, before you go, before you go. Oh, my pen my desk. <laughs> this hard drive contains 111 <laughs> songs. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, you need to put the hard drive away. Put the hard drive away. We cannot give anything away because we told the composer. But you know him. He, he knows you. Many of you voted for his song because it came quite high. Songs, plural. But like, we can't say anything. So, for now, we will see you later. Bye!